I'm Jim Huff from the University of Glasgow and what I've got here today is an example of um, space-time as predicted by Albert Einstein. Now Einstein in his general relativity predicted that masses would curve space-time and you imagine this rubber sheet here as an example of flat space-time. We're building along the Sun, the Sun curves space-time as you see the rubber sheet becomes curved and that curvature is what allows you know, the Earth to, to orbit the Sun, for example, like that, or it allows satellites to orbit the Earth, or it allows two objects like this, which are maybe closer in size and weight, you know, to orbit, to orbit each other if they will stay on the rubber sheet, which they are not doing. But all of these things, you see, that are affected by the curvature of space-time. Now what gravitational waves are, are ripples on this surface, this rubber surface, are ripples in space-time. So you can imagine gravitational waves are ripples like that. And what they do is, because a structure like this, to expand and contract and expand and contract, but only by tiny or infinitesimally small amounts. 